Okay, ladies and gentlemen, Bud Walker here, and my wife ordered this new Gotham Steel, I think 90 half inch frying pan. Of course, it needs no oil or butter needed. Made with titanium and ceramic, stronger than ever. So, uh, I'm going to give it a try and see what happens. I saw the commercials. Hold on, here we go. Okay, so my favorite corned beef hash, great value, down at Walmart. I'm giving you guys a plug, so I hope you give me a discount next time I come to your store if you see my video. Okay, as I said, uh, great value corned beef hash. Uh, this is the best corned beef hash I've, I've had because it has no, not a lot of water. Anyway, uh, I won't show you all the details. And I'm going to open this baby up and put it right in the pan. Oh boy, look at that. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Yes, sir. We about to get down. Get down this morning. Okay. I got it in the pan. Now, this is going to be a man's way to do this. I know you women up there uh, got your own way because y'all the best cooks, but this is how I do my corned beef hash. But I'm trying out this new pan, see how it works. Probably non stick, non scratch. All that's good stuff. Let me get my season. So this is all I need. Lowry seasoned salt, one egg, and some open pit. I I heard that in the background. No, no Richards, okay? No wild Irish rolls this morning. <laughs> okay, I got this baby on medium heat. And I'll just wait for it to start simmering. Okay, it's starting to cook. You can hear it. Mmm. Yeah. Okay, I'm back. Spread this out a little bit. A little Lowry is on there. Not much. And I'll put a little top on there just to simmer. Let it simmer some before I turn it. Yeah, we also got this uh, Gotham Steel grill also. Does on cook on both sides. Uh, we did steaks last night. They came out very well. We also got the Gotham Steel uh, grill. We cooked steaks only last night. They came out really well. Uh, you can cook on both sides. I'm gonna try the pancakes and stuff on this side eventually. See how that works out. Last night we did grill. We get uh, steaks and hot dogs and uh, no steaks and hamburgers. Last night we grilled onions. Meanwhile, my hash browns are looking good. Oh yeah! Let them babies simmer. Mm-hmm. Looking real good. Let this baby go. Okay, it's been simmering for a while, so I'm going to take my lid off, let it air out a little bit before I put my egg on there and my barbecue sauce. <laughs> so far, this uh, pan works pretty well. This non-stick, just moves all around. Wow, look at that. No problems with that. And now, <laughs> for the open pit, I only need a smidgen, yeah baby, yeah, Oop, that's it, that's all I need, I think, I don't know how you taste it, mm-hmm, yeah, I'm gonna let it get a little crispy, stay on there about another, maybe another five minutes, you're supposed to use this under medium heat. But it's doing pretty well. I don't want to turn the heat up. Ruin the instructions. Spread this baby out before I put my egg on there. So I'm going to cook. Uh, another five minutes, maybe or less. Then I'll put the egg on. We'll see how we go. Ah, look at that. 
A little crispy, golden brown. Yeah. That's how you do it, baby. Okay, now I put my egg on there. Yeah, just a tad of salt, not much. There we go. Give it a couple minutes, done. Okay, I put my top back on and let my egg cook a little faster. Ooh, yeah. Yep, 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 I like that. Look at that. See? Still, it doesn't even stick. Still move this baby around. Holy crap. Okay, a couple more minutes. And I'm done! <laughs> okay, baby. This look good. Here we go. Yeah, bring it over to the plate. Look at that. Whoa. Slides right out. Oh, turn off the fire. I might actually put this on YouTube. <laughs> Look at that. See, I have crispy brown. It could have burned it a little bit if I wanted to. But nope. That's fine for me. Yeah. Okay. Normally, I would wash this out. But just to show... Just using a paper towel here. And voila, it's done. Clean. No fuss, no mess. <laughs>